Hello all, welcome to our new series Learn German Easily. In this video, we will be learning negative article in dative case. Sometimes we do have indirect object in the sentence. If we have indirect object in the sentence, sentence construction would be first position subject, which is always in nominative case. Second position will be of verb in conjugated form, and after that, you can write your indirect object. Now, as we know, indirect objects are always dative. If you don't know how to find indirect objects in the sentence, you can check our related video. I'll give link here on our button and in description box. Now, at this indirect object position, if you are writing any noun with negative article, then that negative article should be dative in order to change that object into dative case. Let us see negative article in dative. Masculine singular negative dative article is kainam. Feminine singular negative dative article is kainer. Neutral singular negative dative article is kainam. For all three masculine, feminine, and neutral, plural article negative dative article is kainen plus n. Kainen is negative article, and n will be the ending for your plural noun. Their mantle past kainam gast. Pasen is dative verb which needs indirect object in the sentence. Gast is indirect object in the sentence which is masculine gender noun. And that is why whatever negative article we are using that should be dative negative. That is why kainam is dative negative article used for masculine gender object gast. Do most Kainer Person Wehatun. Person is feminine gender noun which is indirect object in this sentence. So if we are using negative article for person that should be dative negative for feminine and that is why Kainer is dative negative article used for person indirect object. The tier Shaden Kainan Kindern. Kinder is plural noun which is indirect object in this sentence. Now according to the table if you observe plural negative dative article is kainen plus n. So that n is the ending for your plural noun. Here kinder is plural noun and that is why n is ending added to kinder noun and kainen is dative negative plural article. Estut kainum deep light wagon eines diebstahl. Deep is masculine gender noun which is indirect object in the sentence. We are using negative article for deep and that is why that negative article should be in dative case and that is why kainum is there for deep indirect object. Sie werdet kainum rat folgen. Rat is masculine gender noun. Folgen is dative verb. When we use folgen in this sentence, meaning of folgen is to follow. So what we follow that should be in dative case. Now rat is masculine gender noun. We are using negative article for rat. And this negative article should be in dative case as we need to change this noun into dative. I hope you have understood how to use negative article in dative case. Thank you for watching this video.